Hey there, so I'm Mr. Cat or Misty, and you don't use anvils correctly. Please let me teach you, you're wasting so many levels. So what people normally do, they'll take a sword, they'll add sharpness one, they'll add sharpness one to get two, they'll get sharpness three, sharpness four, sharpness five. You can see this one already costs 20 levels to get sharpness five. However, you'll see that if we add sharpness five to another sword, this one only costs five. Why did this one cost 20, but this one cost five? Items in Minecraft have a secret stat called anvil uses. The more anvil uses something has, the more levels it takes to put it in an anvil. The trick to getting really high level enchantments for no cost at all is to keep your anvil uses as low as possible. So the way anvils work is the first slot item is put onto the second slot item. So if I have a sharpness one with zero anvil uses, and a sharpness one with zero anvil uses, this is being added to this. So this is zero plus one. So this is a one anvil use sharpness two book. This book has gone through the anvil one time. So if we make another one, this is zero anvil uses plus one book is a one anvil use sharpness two book. Gone through the anvil one time. And here's some proof for you. Here's the one anvil use sharpness two book with a one anvil use sharpness two book. So this is one anvil use plus one is two. This book has gone through the anvil two times. And if you saw that costs five levels to make this. However, if you put a sharpness two with zero anvil uses and a sharpness two with zero anvil uses, this is zero plus one means this is a one anvil use for only three. So there's already a two level difference just in sharpness three books. So what players normally do is they'll take their sword, they'll add their enchantment, they'll add a new 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 enchantment, and then they'll add a new enchantment. See, only 129 levels for this last enchantment. That's not that bad. However, what someone who knows what they're doing is gonna do is they're gonna take these. So this book has one anvil use, gone through the anvil one time, merge these, this book has one anvil use. Merge these. This book has one anvil use. So what you may be thinking next is, oh, we should add these two together to get another one anvil use book. That's wrong. You wanna have one extra book always at the end that has zero so that your final book will only have one anvil use. So what we wanna do is put a one anvil use and a one anvil use. So again, this is one and you're adding one to it. So this book has been through the anvil two times. We're gonna add the two anvil use to a zero anvil use that only costs seven. And again, if you put it the other way, that's 20, but you wanna add this to the zero. So this book only has one anvil use and then one anvil use plus one anvil use, 15 that way or 29 that way. So we wanna take the 15. All right. And now we're gonna add the two anvil use book to the zero anvil use book and get all this for 17 levels. If you put it the other way, it's 43, but this way it's seven because it's zero plus one. So to get the final enchantment on this sword, it costs like 128 or something levels. I don't remember, I'm just guessing. But for this sword, to add a new diamond sword to a one anvil use book only costs 61 levels. That's less than half of what it was before. Look at that. I understand that this can be a little hard to understand, so as always, I'll be in the comments to answer questions. But here's a video I think you might like, along with a playlist of videos that you should just watch. Just please watch all, just watch all my videos. Don't stop. Just keep watching them. Never stop. Never leave.